to see you today. This is Teacher Via, and today we will learn more about beat, rhythm, and rhythm patterns. Let us review what is beat. Can you feel your heartbeat? Beat is the steady pulse. Can you do it with me? Ready, go. Beat is the steady pulse. Now let us sing our hello song as we clap the beat. Ready, sing, hello, 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 it's music time. Thank you for singing. Now this time, let us try to sing the song and clap the words. Are you ready? Here we go. Hello, 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 hello. It's music time. The way the words go in music is called rhythm. Also, the rhythm is a combination of long and short notes. Can you do it with me? The rhythm is a combination of long and short notes. Today, we're going to learn about different notes. Let's see if you can still remember them. Are you ready? The first note that we're going to learn looks like this. It has a note head with a shade and a stem. Do you remember the name of this note? It starts with letter Q. You're right. It's quarter note. The quarter note has one count. Can you think of a fruit name that has one sound? It's grape. Now I have here a rhythm pattern of four quarter notes. Let us play and recite the fruit name grape. Are you ready? Grape, 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 grape. Now it's your turn. Play the rhythm. Ready, go. Good job. The next note looks like this. It has a note head with a shade, a stem, and a hook but it can also be a pair and when they become a pair they are beamed together this note starts with the letter e do you recall the name of this note if you answered eighth note you're right the eighth note gets one half count of a quarter note but if it becomes a pair then it becomes one count the rhythm of a pair of eighth note sounds like this. Can you think of a fruit name that has two sounds or two syllables? If you answered apple or orange or mango or cherry, you're all correct. I have here four pairs of eighth notes. Let us play and recite the fruit name. It goes like this. Apple, 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 apple. Now it's your turn to play the rhythm. Ready, go. Good job. Now the third note that we're going to learn looks like this. It has a note head with no shade and a stem. This note starts with letter H. Do you recall the name of this note? If you answered half note, you're correct. Now the half note has two counts. It is longer than a quarter note. And the fruit name that we will use is pear. I have here two half notes. The rhythm goes like this. 
pear, pear. Can you clap the rhythm? Here we go. Good job. Now, the last note that we're going to learn looks like this. A simple note head with no shade. The note starts with letter W. Do you recall the name of this note? If you answered whole note, you're correct. The whole note has the longest count because it has four counts. I have here a whole note. Let's clap the rhythm. One, two, three, four. Can you clap the rhythm? Ready, go. Now let's play a rhythm game. Before we start, I want you to get an instrument with you if you do have a drum or a shaker or a pair of rhythm sticks. But if you don't have, you may get any object that creates sound at your home. You can get a pair of pencils or other instruments that create sound. I hope you do remember all the notes and their number of counts, also the rhythm fruit names. I will present a series of rhythm patterns and I want you to play it using your instrument or your object with you that creates sounds, recite the fruit name, and also the words or phrases that are presented after the notes. Are you ready? Let's start with rhythm number one. These are made up of two quarter notes. Play and recite the fruit name. Ready, go. It goes like this. Grape, grape. And our word for the pattern is lock down. Let us play the pattern and recite the word. Here we go. Lock down. Good. Next, rhythm number two. It has a pair of eight note and one quarter note. Play and recite the fruit name. Ready, go. It goes like this. Apple grape. And the word for the pattern is quarantine. Let us play and recite the word. Ready, go. Quarantine. Did you get it right? We still have rhythm number three. It's a quarter note and a pair of eight note. Play and recite the fruit name. Ready, go. It goes like this. Grape, apple. And our word for the pattern is pandemic. Let us play and recite the word. Here we go. Pandemic. Good job. We still have more to go. Rhythm number four. It's two pair of eight notes. Play and recite the fruit name. Ready, go. The rhythm goes, apple, apple. And the phrase for the pattern is, toilet paper. Let us play and recite the pattern. Ready, go. Toilet paper. Rhythm number five goes like this. Two pair of eight notes and one half note. Play and recite the fruit name. Here we go. It goes like this. Apple, apple, pear. And the phrase for the pattern is flattening the curve. Let us play and recite the pattern. Here we go. Flattening the curve. The last rhythm is this. One whole note. Play and count the pattern. Ready, go. It goes like this. One, two, three, four. And the word for the pattern is help. Let us play and recite the pattern. Here we go. Help. Good job. 
Did you get the rhythm patterns right? Now, did you observe that the rhythm patterns are related to the situation we're experiencing right now? I do hope that these rhythm patterns will help you remember the notes that we learned today, their number of counts, and the rhythm fruit names that we learned as well. Thank you for joining us today. See you next time!